Hello everybody, welcome back to Divinity, Original Sin. Now we're back out in the area where we were last time, last episode. So we should continue to journey and see what we can find. Some barrels there, we'll get those straight away. Empty. Nope, water barrel, we don't want that. Right, this is the area where we, we did the last fight on the last episode, so hopefully there's something at the top of here. There's a chest. What have we got? Why are we on dunes? That's got to go to the, the bad earth tour. Send that to all grey. Is that any good for him? No, because the one he's using it is massive. <laughs> Alright, okay. I'm sure we're bound to get in a fight up here. Or around here somewhere. Please? And let's hope it's not too high a level. Because we're heading over to the east side here, I think. What's this for? I hope those dead dogs don't find me. Somebody is talking. Aha. Mercy me, it walks, but it is not dead. I was merely, in I wasn't entirely certain I'd ever meet anyone any more fitting that description. The name's Wolfram, and it's delight to make your acquaintance. Good to see, by the by, you don't belong to the Legion. Ten of their number accompanied me on a fact-finding mission to an ancient burial mound. As it turns out, they stood a snowflake's chance in hell against the undead. Oh, so this is one of the other quests then. And I reckon my chances are higher though, especially with those vicious undead mutts prowling the grounds around this here ruin. I'd go so far as to say I'm in dire need of an armed escort back to the city, as a matter of fact. Tell me a bit more about yourself. I'm an archaeologist, a connoisseur of the undead. Because of my expertise, Captain Orius, the commander of the Legion in Sicil, wanted me to investigate the ancient burial mound just outside of town. Hoping to uncover the source of the zombie plague. No such luck though. So you know about a lot about the undead, you say? Quite so. I live for the dead, so to speak. Combination of archaeology and a case of incidental necromantic magic is what sparked my interest in the field. Of course, I'll be glad to share what knowledge I have obtained over the years. Zombies. Zombies are the results of vile necromancy in action. Among the resurrected dead are those who used to be wizards. They can cast spells still, yes I know that. They slay their prey and bring them back as deathless thralls that fester with the d diseases of decay. What about skeletons? These ones in particular, the ones around Sicil, are resurrected soldiers of Bracchus, the last and most infamous line of sorcerer kings. He himself is supposed to be buried somewhere around here, but no one knows where the actual grave is. Long have I searched and deep have I dug, but so far I haven't found anything more spectacular than rusted weaponry and shards of pottery. Be that it may, Bracchus soldiers stalk these lands anew, and they still fight like veterans. I told those fool legionnaires to bring maces instead of swords, you know, weapons that crush these skeletons' bones, not blades that may ricochet right off. Hell, even a sturdy branch would do a better job. Well, they didn't listen, and now they're dead. So that brings up the uh, the crush weapons and slash weapons. Luckily, I'm using crush. Oh, and don't be surprised if the dead are unusual amount of magic against you. These soldiers loyal to sorcery king after all. Dark magic all around. About that armed escort. I'll never make it back to Sarsi alone, but you've gotten this far, you can bring me back, can't you? 
certainly can. Let's be off. Indeed, don't worry, we'll keep you safe. Marvelous, mighty fine of you. Lead the way, I say. Until we meet again. All right. Please don't let them be too high a level. Oh, there we go. What have we got? Level four. Ideal. Uh, Please crush these fiends before they crush me. Into a little kaboom. I once put in the grave here. Help me. <laughs> have you heard him? Can she reach? To no, me, of course she can't. Me. I'm under attack. He won't be able to reach, so we'll bring you forward. He'll go for you first, hopefully. Uh, yes, can reach. Stun failed. Don't run off. Hmm. All right. Well, we'll. Uh, I once put in the grave here. Help me. Let us summon Spidey straight away. See if we can get some other away from this fool who keeps running away. Teleport him to Logre, yes. I once put in the grave here. Help me. Seventy-two damage, very nice. Spider can take care of this one. Um, just in case you're wondering where I got the, that from, <laughs> I shot. I did go back to town and, and sell some stuff and, and buy a couple of spells. Right. Zap him. Ah, he's stunned, excellent. Yes. No time to pick up stuff, I'll have to come back and get that. No, it's, we're at town, that's alright. You did it, we made it. Cheers for escorting me to safety. You're a godsend, you are. I'll be in the King's Crab clearing the dust from my throat. Drinks are on me if you like to partake. Until we meet again. Oh, okay, well, let's go and pick up this stuff that's dropped. Don't want to leave that on the floor, do we? Like that. Must be some more over here. Didn't that skelly drop anything? Not 
obviously not. Right, we did notice there was a a trap door here, so we'll check that in a sec. Just check these boxes that we didn't get a chance to do. Anything there? No. Nope. Okay, let's go downstairs. Bread, we'll take that. I don't know why I'm taking these because I probably won't find time to do any crafting, but. Why has the music changed? Oh, bone pile. Always makes me uneasy when the music changes and there's uh, nothing obvious. Oh, pickaxe. That means we can now mine as well. Chest. Rough pool, that'll do nicely. Uh, barrel. No. Bottle, empty bottle, empty bottle, don't want that. Check the books. Oh, yes, new recipe. Uh, potatoes, mash nature's jarreth of all trades, mash and boil them, cut them into strips and fry them up real nice. Okay. And. String enthusiasts. Mixing poison with certain objects can produce elixir powerful enough to affect a particular attribute of an intended victim. A tooth dissolved within a strong poison, for instance, will leach the strength from man's arm in an instant. It would be difficult to pour such concoction down his throat during combat, but caught in an arrowhead can deliver a dose of poison straight to the target. Oh, cool, okay. Weight at 112 or 190. What is that? Unique. It's got to be for a quest or something. That's got to be. All right. Well, it doesn't appear to be anything else of any interest down here. I don't think. What's that there? Nothing on the wall, is there? That I'm missing. Oh, rat. Come here, rat. Come here, Jules. Attack this thing. That creature looks like it wants to play fetch with our feelings. Mm, it does. A, a zombie dog. Man's best friend by I It should die from the burning.
Oh, I can reach it though. Bye bye. And her weapon needs doing. 18 to 30. Oh, look at the difference in that. Didn't realise I had that. Oh, look at this. Look at these here. on the go. Yeah, save the points. Move forward a little bit. with that no Get rid of that. nope okay oh, damn it arches they frozen spidey Zombie boar. Where's the archer? Can't reach. You if we can. Yes, that'll do nicely. Old Grey can smack that about the head. Oh, nice damage there. Well done, Old Grey. Excellent. points for that. Let's move forward a little bit. Yeah, Alright, we need to get in and get these before they uh, cause some serious damage. Nice one by the two. Uh, you can club him to death. Thank you. You can't reach him though. Maybe next go. Because I want you to try and blind him. Blind fail, damn it. Yeah, 
just blinded him. See what we've got. First of all, we need to put a little heel on the ranger. Silver arrow, that will come in handy later in life. These bodies, hair, ew. And a chest. I don't think any of that's any good. Mm, no, I don't think it will be. Oh, that might be. No. No, definitely not. That can go to the ranger. Johan, have a look at that. Oh, it's slightly better. Yeah, we can have that equip. So not too ugly. How's the weapon doing? 6J of 70. Oh, I've got time yet. Alright folks, we'll leave it there for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget, if you do like the videos, please leave me a like and subscribe. This is Old Grey, signing off.